Roy City Republican Brian Sladen is accused of having an inappropriate relationship with an intern who is younger than 21 years old. The House General Investigating Committee is looking into that claim and the ethics of the state representative. The complaint obtained by Texas Tribune alleged Sladen called the intern over to his condo on March 31st and drank alcohol with the underage intern. A legislative staffer filed the complaint, which was confirmed by another person who knew about the incident. Austin City Council members are expected to get briefed on the partnership between Austin Police and Texas DPS next week. Councilwoman Vanessa Fuentes claims the decision for the partnership was made behind closed doors without City Council members. Fuentes says she wants to look into what areas are being patrolled by DPS and what kind of arrests are being made. That briefing will take place Tuesday, April 18th. A fifth victim has died from their injuries after a shooting inside a Louisville bank this morning. Eight people remain in the hospital, including two police officers. Investigators say the shooter, a 25-year-old bank employee, opened fire inside a conference room. Police arrived within three minutes of being dispatched and got into a shootout with a gunman, killing him. We have a break room. I got in there and shut the door for a second. And then I was looking around, the, opened the door to see where he was at. And I could see him still shooting. I didn't see his face. And then I took off running out the front door. CNN reports a suspect had been told he was going to be fired and wrote a note to his parents and a friend stating he planned to open fire in the bank. It's not clear whether the note was seen before the shooting or after. Kentucky's governor, who lost a close friend in the shooting, has ordered flags lowered to half-staff until Friday evening. Stay with us. We'll be right back after this break.